What's up guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to duplicate armor on Minecraft Bedrock, not Minecraft Java. Uh, this design is by JC Plays. I will link his video and his channel in the description below. So if you guys enjoy, make sure you hit that subscribe button and like. And without further ado, let me show you guys a super easy and super simple way to duplicate armor in Minecraft Bedrock. So first you want to start off by opening a crafting table, putting a brown mushroom a spider eye and a sugar in this pattern below and getting a fermented spider eye which you're going to use later to make a potion. So next what you're going to do is take eight golden nuggets, surround them in a circle and inside that circle you want to put a melon which will make you a glistering melon which you will also use to make a potion. So you get three glass bottles and fill them up with water. Now that you have just your water bottles go ahead and open up your brewing stand that you already put blaze powder into to give it power. So then go ahead and drop your water bottles into there and put in nether warts so you can start getting an awkward potion. And once that finishes up, you get a little noise and your water bottles will turn into awkward potions. So next what you want to do is just drop a glistening melon into there that you already created. And I just sped it up for you guys' sake. So now that your glistening melon is done brewing, uh, you have potion of healing. And then next what you want to do is put your fermented spider eye back into that brewing stand and also let that go again. And once the fermented spider eye is all done, you have a potion of harming instant damage. But this is only one and you want it to be even more powerful so you put in a glowstone dust which will increase the power on it and make it instant damage too. Now once all of that's done, you will have Potion of Harming Instant Damage 2, and this is the potion that you want to be using for your duplication glitch. So next what you can do is you can fill a cauldron with this potion, or any potion, but in this instance we're going to be using Potion of Harming. So next you want to get your arrows. I'm going to be using 6 because I'm doing this experiment three different times instead of just two, but you guys can just use two if you're doing it once. Go ahead and dip that into the cauldron and this gives you arrow of harming instant damage too. Our next step is to make the duplication machine, which is super simple. I like to dig a hole and put a chest right there and then below that chest have a hopper and just keep having those that'll collect all the armor for you so that way you don't really have to and it'll try and attempt for you not to crash, but you can still crash if you know, you're not being very careful. But basically, it's just to fill in this hole and place the hopper on top, and then we can start building our thing. So then, all of the armor is going to go into this hopper. So what you want to do is place five blocks right here, drop down, place five drop blocks right here, go ahead and drop down, place three, and then just leave an empty space and then hop to the back, and then place ladders on the back. And then go ahead and climb up that ladder and then like face that way and place the piston so the piston is facing like towards the inside and then place a block in front of it and then place three blocks across in the front and then drop down and place two and then go ahead and go on the inside and get your lever and put your lever right under the piston so that way when you flick the lever you can turn the piston on and off. So now you're ready to do the actual duplication clip but we have the netherite armor that has not thorns 3 on it. You have to have thorns 3 on it in order for this duplication to work. So I'm just going to be showing you guys here that once you use armor that does not have thorns on it, that it does not duplicate. So what you want to do is shoot your two arrows right there, drop down, step around, set your spawn in a bed real quick so that way you can come right to it. And then when you hit the levers, you'll just die, but nothing it will duplicate. So now that you have the netherite armor that has enchanted with all thorns, you can actually do the duplication glitch because you have thorns on all your stuff. So what you want to do is go ahead and go back up to the top of your machine. You can shoot your two arrows down into the pistons. And then you can drop back down through the back, step around it. And then once you hit that lever to kill yourself, it'll say that you died a bunch of times and it'll duplicate all your armor. So now you have a bunch of armor. This is probably one of the most broken duplication glitches ever, and it's super easy to do. It's pretty crazy. So all you have to do is just set your spawn by at, uh, shoot the harming arrows into the piston, step under the piston, make sure you're wearing a full set of thorns gear, 
and then have the arrows drop down and kill you, and it'll just kill you a bunch of times, dropping constantly redropping your armor, and you can just fill chests up with this armor, so you will never run out of armor. And it's not just nether you can do it, you can do it with chainmail, gold, diamond, iron, every single kind of armor you can get, you can do it with this glitch. Now the final thing I'm going to be showing you guys is if you can use a almost fully enchanted netherite armor. So let's say you have the maxed out amount of armor and you're going to go do this. That way, you know, if you lose it, you're going to be okay. So let's go ahead and test this out. See what happens. Go ahead and drop down, walk around, step in, and boom. So it crashed my game. And I was like, well, maybe it was just once. So I tried it again, but it also crashed again. So I'm just going to assume that A, my PC can't handle it, which it should, or B, you just can't. Like, it's impossible. You just, it's over. It's just, that's it. So another really cool thing you can do with this glitch is you can place a hopper and below that hopper, a blast furnace. To the left of that, a hopper with coal in it, feeding into the blast furnace. So that'll just give it the fuel source. And below that, a hopper going into a chest. So it'll smelt stuff and then put that straight into the chest. So basically, if you have an all set of iron armor with thorns three, and you just fill up this little hole, and you go up to the top and you shoot in your arrows, and you do the duplication gets from there, it'll duplicate your iron uh, armor. So then that hopper will collect all that iron armor for you, put that into the blast furnace, cook that up into iron nuggets, and then you can turn those iron nuggets into iron ingots, which is just a simple little uh, iron farm that anybody can do. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of the Minecraft Duplication Kits where you can duplicate any armor that has Thorns 3 on it. If you enjoyed, make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. And a big thank you goes out to JC Plays for finding this glitch. I will link everything down below. With that being said, I will see you guys next time. Peace out. Hey, hey, hey. Christmas is lit. Hey, hey, hey. Christmas is lit. Hey, hey, hey.